Previously on Cyberpunk 2077. Never did tell me why you're looking for her. How do I know you won't be any worse than whatever's going on in there? Doubt it's the best time to discuss this. Right about that. Should have just told me when I asked you the first time. I need to know your intentions are good. Simple. Gotta find out who hired her. Whoever they are, I need their help and quick. Otherwise, I'm screwed. Wait. What is that? Is that Evelyn? Okay, so... Um, Evelyn's live, Judy. Now back to Cyberpunk 2077, episode 16. Close to the studio, I think. You find anything useful? Read up the elevator. Should be easier to get out of here. Come out. I only want to talk. That's Evelyn. Just don't touch her. Okay. If she's recording, you'll scramble her brain. Wait until I cut her link. Okay. Fuck's sakes. Break the link at my end at the same time. Okay. All right, let's do this. Oh, Evelyn. Wait for my signal. Here goes. Ready? And now. Evelyn. Thank God. Ev. Evelyn, you hear me? Oh my god. Is she okay to be moved? No brain hemorrhages, damage to the spine? She doesn't seem to have any wounds. It just if bruises. No oh lord. What's wrong with her? Honestly, I don't know. She's gotta be seriously traumatized. Let's get her somewhere safe. Come on. Fast, too. Which oh way? Oh my god. I sealed the doors. And manage to power the elevators. Elevators it is then. Come on, baby, let's go. Oh my god, Evelyn. Shit. No time to lose, V. Gotta get her out of here. Yeah, 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 come on, come on. Listen, Evelyn, everything's going to be okay, okay, honey? Is it really that hard? What do you mean? Please, just one. For me. Oh, fuck off, Johnny. Smoking's for posers, and it stinks too. Say whatever the fuck you want, but just light up. No. <laughs> non smokers are the fucking worst. Just my luck. Sucks to be you, right? We going in? Mm. What's there to wait for? Didn't go through hell and back just to stand in front of a door. No oh, shit, not good. Oh shit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Breathe breathe in, breathe out, okay? Come on, V. Breathe in, breathe out. Okay. Everything's gonna be fine. It's just a relic. Oh lord. So this is Judy's place. Nice. I like the little drawings on the wall. She's sleeping. Uh, at least I think she is. Her eyes are closed and she's not shaking anymore. I would have already killed her by now if I didn't feel so bad for her. Oh man. How's she feeling? Use your imagination. That place sucked every last drop of humanity from her. It's not enough. She already gave up everything she had. I just kept taking more and more. She's in some kind of trance, like she's folded into herself. No reaction to her surroundings whatsoever. Fuck. I really 
I really didn't want to poke around in her head. I did it for you. I just want you to know that. I'm sorry, Judy. I appreciate it, though, but... You're mad at her. Why? When you asked me to scour her behavioral chip, I was just about done dealing with your shit. Hmm. Judy, I didn't have any I know. Either. It's okay. So I don't get why... You'll find out in a sec. I'll show you the virtue I found. Guessing you saw them already. Yeah. Had to wrestle to make sense of the whole thing. But I don't want to say anything and taint your perspective. You should go in with fresh eyes. Okay. Okay. Show me. Give me a sec while I set the parameters. Guess we'll find out if our doll really did lose her tune. Come on, V. I'll be the first to admit this does not look good. Oh, Evelyn. Evelyn? Oof, okay. Well, now, look at you. Hey, how you feeling? Need anything? Not here to nag. Just talk. Look at all those bruises, holy shit. Listen, Evelyn, I really need your help. It's important. If I don't do anything and do it soon, I'll die. I know it's a bad time, but I gotta ask. You got any idea how to remove the biochip? Or know anyone else who might? No. You're right. This is a complete waste of time. She's beyond just responding to anything. Oh, Evelyn. Holy fuck. Have a seat. Okay. All right. Roll it. Data was in pretty rough shape. Not all that editable. Huh. Glad you managed to salvage him in the first place. Needs a second to load. Okay. Quality's lousy, but I did what I could. What am I looking out for? Every single piece of tech I see? Security? We need a layout of the whole room. We will get everything else we need from the virtue. What about his messages? Only if you can do it in the parfait bourré. It's most important that he suspect nothing. Try to be your usual relax self. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, should I... Biochip? Will you hear this? That is not of interest to me. You spin the virtue, you come back here. We give you the edges. That is your one job. The rest is none of your concern. Understand? Hmm. Wow, so that definitely gives me some insight on who she's working for. So let me restart and then take a look around if you want. Can't see her face. Under normal circumstances, that kind of encryption's easy to crack. But not this time. Whoever she is, she's got serious net running skills. Hmm. That or someone's working it for her. Evelyn here tells us. I think I recognize these. What are they? Viv markings. You familiar with them? Not enough to know what they actually mean. Heard of who might use them, though. Who? Could be the voodoo boys, but that's just a hunch. Can't be 100% sure. The spine chilling Netrunner crew? Hard to find because they don't want to be. I wouldn't know where to start. Damn, that's inconvenient. Every single piece of tech. Every we need single piece of tech, I see. What about his messages? Okay, let me see. What about here? 
Try to be your usual and relax self. What am I looking at here? I already looked at her. Hi, Evelyn. Wait a minute. Let me play. And if he starts talking about the biochip himself, uh, should I be out of and Might not if be he important. starts talking about the biochip himself, all of them should I Pacifica. Narrows down our search at least. What now? Looks like I'm going on a field trip to Pacifica. Okay. All right, think we got everything. What do you think? Now we know what happened to Clouds. They're the ones who tried to flatline her. Launched a nuke at her chip. Fuck. So it was punishment? For getting played by her? She knew more than they thought she knew. Couldn't let that go. So that's who she was running from. Woman who hired Evelyn. Any idea who we're up against? Your guess is as good as mine. Sorry, V. Looks like Evelyn never told us the whole truth. That's why you're She's mad. Me. If I'd known what she'd gotten herself into, <clears throat> I'm so mad at her. Her only job was to record a virtue. Pretty damn amazing she managed to organize a full-blown heist. And swipe the biochip from under her boss's noses. So that's where you came in. She hired you. Yep. And brought this all on herself. On you two. There's one more recording. Wanna see it? Yeah, sure. Sure, why not? Nothing can surprise me at this point. Okay, so another recording of Evelyn, and she's spying. So I have a good feeling all I need is to basically go through the Trabian. This is French. Haitian Creole. It is the voodoo voice. Didn't I? Wait, let me see if I've got an auto translator. Meantime, you try to tune into the phone's frequency. See what the other side's saying. Try scanning the phone. Oh, yes, yeah, scan, right? Uh. Huh. No, no scan. Okay. Okay. There you go. I found it. Got it. Give it a second. All right. You're an Obu. Probably why Evelyn buried this recording deep. Cut another name. Something like Silverhand? <gasps> Johnny? We have to know what they're saying. Could be important. Fine. Just found the auto translate package. Should get along fine with your system. I'll install it now. Oof. I'm having goosebumps already. All right, so Oui, les allez. Vous avez bien raison, moi j'ai tout intelligent pour ça. Pour On pense même cela fait nous problème. On n'est pas enragé. En plus, c'est plus bon moyen nous gagner pour nous rêver sur un autre. Faut que nous pour chance là. Moi t'as même quoi même j'avais au que Sylvain a mené nous direct sous Alt. Why would they mention Serhand? Très bien. Okay, Judy, we're good. All right, disconnecting. Ah, 
she wants to know about Silverhand. Okay, um... Long story. Trust me. Go ahead. I'm all ears. Hmm. Now's not the best time. Can you give me a minute? I need to go over some stuff. In my head. Uh, um, of course. Yes, I can talk to Johnny. Thank you. You know who they are? Who the woman is? Any idea how we find them? Fuck, V. I've been dead the last half century. Sorry if I'm unable to hand you all the answers on a chrome fucking platter when you snap your fingers. Come on, Johnny. It's not like that, bro. People, what could they want from Alt? How the hell should I know? Got no notion whatsoever? One way or another, everything leads back to that net runner. Finding her is our biggest priority. If she knows as much as I think she knows about the chip, she can help us out. Thought mm. you said nothing could help us. Nah, just find us that juju wirehead, okay? Okay. I guess, whatever. Okay, Wait, Judy. You got any idea how to get in touch with the Voodoo Boys? Mm. Why? Worried that I'll give Evelyn up to him? No. I didn't trust you at first, but... Well, if you wanted to get back at Evelyn, you would have done it already. So I why the worried look? I just... I don't want it all to work out for you. You got a plan? Sure, you worried about me? I'll ask around. Make a few calls. Let me put it this way. The voodoo boys wouldn't trust a cat if it walked onto their turf. But someone's gotta know a way in. Well, good luck. I hope you won't need it. Thank you. See you around, Judy. Right. Um, thanks, V. Anytime. Thank you. Okay, so I'm meeting talking more uh, oh seems pretty uh, secluded here it is appropriate for such a secret meeting what the hell happened of course the awful <laughs> you see a man robbed of his implants money and dignity look well damn I'm sorry bro it is not all bad I am mostly unnoticed in the streets friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Oh, Hanako shit. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at Anchor in the Bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes. And if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. That's if he believes us. Sure you can trust him? Yes. <laughs> Convincing. Very. I have nothing to lose. Is that better? Worse? Cause I got plenty to lose. I do have a good point there. I mean, the chip, my life. By God, huh? A good sign. Oh Maybe shit. All right. Let's see how this meeting goes. Cause I have a good feeling it could turn into a shit show. For myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. Not gonna like what I'm about to say. I need a guarantee I'm safe here. You are, you have it. B, you can trust all that. All right, then. Compeki Plaza. I was there the night it happened. Looked like your typical family quarrel until. Your Nobu lunged at Saburo and started choking. Silence. Not one word more. What do you mean? You will bring death to your door. What? But it is the truth. 
Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about a silly parade? Fool! Toji's not going well. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath to do my duty. But you can't ignore the truth! The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. I knew it wasn't gonna go well. price on your head. I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to your inaba summer. Sorry, but this gonna take much longer. Yeah, clearly it's not going anywhere. Were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to Yorinobu Sama. Consider yourself lucky that I am not you. Oda, not like we're asking for a whole lot here. Just one brief meeting. Hanako should decide if what we say is true. You can't decide for her. Will you help? I will not. Of course but not. I will let you leave this place, this city, unharmed. If I see either of you again, I will not be so lenient. Be very careful, my friend. Your friend? So far from home. Bro, how is he your fucking friend if he blatantly just. this was gonna work mm, yet we walk away with a small measure of success how hmm. how do you figure that what Oda said they return to Tokyo after the parade do you not see that parade it is our chance perhaps if somehow we can get to Hanako-sama we must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japantown. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Bro. H hang on. Not so fast. Make it sound as easy as hacking a schism. But you said yourself, Hanako's got the tightest security in all Night City. Correct. That is why I wish for you to contact us with the local fixer. <laughs> Just the fixer dame. Wakako Okada. Runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Damn, okay. Since you wouldn't go through with all this. Will you join me? Ah, uh, fuck it. Why not? Sure, why not? I didn't know you like jazz. Doesn't seem like you at all. JJ Street. What is this name? <laughs> Just a night city name. Beware. You mock me too often. <laughs> you alright, Goro? Yes. Why the sudden concern? I mean, you did save my life, haven't even killed me, and definitely backed me up when that guy just flat out called me a liar, but... Have shared interests, you and I. Or have you forgotten? Certainly not. Good, because catching lead in Night City is easier than catching a cold. And I need you alive. I am alive and well. As you can see, you should worry about yourself. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Only what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Hmm. Yorinov and his puppets grin at the cameras and insist that everything is under control. But the wider the smile, the bigger the lie. Hmm. I like that. The wider the smile, the bigger the lies. Okay, we are back on Jig Jig Street. I mean, I know he's trying. I can really see that. 
but in all honestly, either they're so heavily corrupted that they don't want to say anything, or they're so blind to the whole situation. The fact that he brought me as a witness to tell his friend what truly happened and for his friend to just basically spit in his face saying that I'm a liar. This shit is fucking crazy. So let's see what we can do with Wakakata. No idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. Hmm, sounds like issues. V, so nice to see you. And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together, that's all. Takemura Goro this. さん、お会いできてこれです。はあ、あ、true Come on, Wakako. We got this. Then get me simpler. So tell me, and mark well, I still have my phone at hand. Mmm, that's cute. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka again. What I fail to understand is why come to me? Did Mr. Deshawn not come to the phone? Huh. Come on, don't play dumb, honey. Come on. Got your finger on the hood's pulse. Know everything. Parade honoring Saburo Arasaka. You're prepping in some way. No doubt. Won't see me dressed in mourning. Hmm. But the rest is true. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. Mm. My gift to you. It's free. Get the Okada fuck out. What is free often proves most costly. Gonna take them or not? You know what? I'm not even gonna fucking ask. Thank you, bro. Japan Town. Whole district. Be sealed off for the parade. Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high up on street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, a guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Mm. Got no idea about security, but given recent Events. Expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner. One at least. Of course. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point. Here. It's an old automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japantown, and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. Hmm. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Not at all curious what we're going to all this trouble for. Blissful ignorance has served me well. In any case, I'll find out soon, won't I? <laughs> You're cute. Thanks, Fukako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. All right.
Wow. We got help handed right to us without any price to pay. Should I be happy or concerned? Mm -hmm. This information, it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Okay, well... Stay safe, Goro. You as well. Until next time. Thank you so much for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies. I hope you stay safe, take care, and I'll see you next time.